Yesterday, Eurovision 2017 winner, Salvador Sobral, did not mince his words when asked about his thoughts on Netta's song Toy and set the fandom ablaze with his blunt comments. Among the many thousands of reactions all over the social media to Salvador's opinion that the Israeli song was horrible came Netta's comment, in the shape of a Twitter reply late last night. Sending only love to Salvador, and to all artists of all genres pick.twitter.com slash mcpixens, Netta Barzilai at Netta Barzilai May 9, 2018 Israeli singer Netta, who is currently the third favorite to win Eurovision 2018 with Toy, replied to Weeblog's tweet with a simple but powerful message. The Loop artist wrote that she was sending only love to Salvador, and to all artists of all genres. The tweet extended an olive branch to the Portuguese singer and was a sign that she did not take his harsh words to heart. Moreover, the same message as availed comment on the fact that music comes in different forms and that all artists are worthy of respect for their artistry. Also interestingly, Netta chose to reply with a photo of her and the current odds-on favorite to win the contest, Eleni Forera from Cyprus, whose song Fuego is bringing the fireworks to Portugal despite Salvador Sobral's hope that his win would put an end to what he called fast food, disposable music. Fans react to Salvador Sobral's comments about Netta's song Netta's only love reaction was a far cry from the comments of many Eurovision fans, who opinion shamed Salvador Sobral for his criticism of Toy. Many of our readers in particular found the Portuguese singer's words unacceptable for a Eurovision winner. For instance, Weeblog's reader J. Pod says, I think it's time Salvador got off his high horse and showed some respect to those who worked really hard to be in this contest. Yes, everyone is entitled to their opinion, but he has come off as rude and disrespectful. Some however defended Salvador Sobral for expressing his blunt opinion about a song that did not match his musical taste. Salvador only replied to a provocative question that was already planned knowing he would give a very harsh but honest opinion on it. We all know that these songs like Toy and Fuego are the type of music he despises the most. Why on earth would be put a smile on his face and praise them knowing this is not music to his ears, Weeblog's reader Charles said. Jacques Houdek, shame on you, Salvador Sobral. But it was not just Eurovision fans who reacted strongly to Salvador Sobral's comments. Last year's Croatian entrant Jacques Houdek was quick to criticize and even attack the Eurovision winner openly, in a lengthy post on Facebook. Just like Salvador Sobril, Jacques Houdek did not mince his words. While defending Netta, he admonished Salvador for not being a gentleman, going as far as to call him rude a poser, fake, a very small person, and demanding an apology in the name of the Eurovision contestants. The Croatian singer also attacked Salvador Sobril for participating in the contest despite being sick and for not attending last year's rehearsals. You may have tricked the entire Europe, but you did not fool me, he added, highlighting the fact that last year's winner was a very divisive figure in the contest not just among Eurovision fans, but also among the artists themselves. There is no suggestion that Salvador's medical condition was exaggerated for Eurovision. Earlier this year, Salvador Successi underwent a life-saving heart transplant operation and is happily recovering. What do you think about Netta's reply and what do you make of Jack Howdeck's angry reaction to Salvador Sobral's comments sound off in the comments section below.